Hi guys, I just wanted to check in with you, see how things are going. Um, the videos that I posted today on Power School, it looks like uh, only one of them got six views and the other one got two views. Um, I really think it would be to your benefit to watch those. Um, please do that because I addressed the questions that you specifically asked me to address, like how to tell the difference between match pairs and two sample. That's a confusing topic. Um, so I think what I'm going to do is post that video, the one with the confusing topics. I'll put that on tomorrow's. Um, day, Tuesday, so that you can watch it. Um, otherwise, there won't be any other new videos for tomorrow or if you're watching this today, Tuesday. Um, I made another Google form and I will be giving you feedback. So what you might have noticed today was when you submitted the form, you did not get immediate feedback. That's a setting I can choose to do. But what I did was go through each of your responses and put comments in, and then I sent it out back to you. So you should receive an email with Monday's um, results and explanations um, to try to help you through that. I'm going to do that again today, Tuesday. Um, Today's is eight questions, so it's shorter. But um, the level added of the level of difficulty is a little bit increased because I'm not walking you through each step like I have been. Um, it's mostly can you find the important pieces of information, like an interval, like a test statistic, like a p-value, and then can you come to the right conclusion? From what I know right now, those of you who are going to take the AP test, um, there's no multiple choice anymore. It'll just be for your response. You will be allowed to take it at home, and you will be allowed to use notes. So we're no longer going to worry about conditions because you're going to use your notes. You're going to write out your conditions beautifully. We're no longer going to worry about formulas because you use your notes you're going to write out your formulas beautifully. So the things that used to be the hardest parts of the panic and phantom problems now should be a breeze because you'll have those to look at. Now what we need to focus on is can you use your calculator? Can you get the right numbers? Can you make the right conclusion? So that's what we're focusing on today's Google form. It's eight questions. You have until our next class period, which is Thursday morning, um, to get that done. But it's eight questions. So I would say just get it done today and then you won't have to worry about it. Um, right now it's nine o'clock at night. Monday night is when I'm recording this. Um, and as of now, nine o'clock, only half of you have done the Google form from today. So I want to be able to give you feedback, but I want to be able to give you timely feedback, and that only happens if you send it to me in a timely manner. Um, <clears throat> what I'm noticing so far is people are either getting it or they're not. And the people who are not getting it, I would refer you to the videos that I've made and tell you to watch those. And then if those don't help, I really, really want to see you guys um, for office hours on the Google Meet because that's where we can get some face-to-face -face help. Um, nobody showed up today, so I'm hoping more people show up tomorrow. I want to see you. I think it's really helpful. I think we need that face-to-face -face time. Um, you know, maybe it was just because it was Monday after spring break and you guys were just starting to get into the swing of things again. That's totally possible. Um, but I want to see you guys. Okay. All right. Well, have a good day today. See me in office hours. Um, email me if you have questions, if you want to do that too, but I really think office hours is the best way to go.
Okay. Bye.